Good morning and welcome back to the channel. Still on the extension. I've uh, got brickwork up to damp proof. Got us uh, blocks in as well, damp proof. So today I'm on with breaking some blocks there for ventilation. Another one over there. That's what those air bricks are over there. So they'll be going to there, obviously. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna fill this with stone today. Uh, this screen, still waiting on the insulation to come in. Uh, but after that, there will be concrete here tomorrow for the slab of the extension. So yeah, hope you enjoy the video. layer of stone in, second two ton tip, if that's what you'll say. Uh, but yeah, we will move this ramp out of the way again, level all that out, and then hit it with the whacker plate again. And then Dad's either stone or sand yet, yeah, we don't know. Uh, but we'll have to see once it's all done. Right, so we've got the pipes in for ventilation. Then there's just a whack plate out, so I don't know. I might have died. Uh, so we've got a stone in. First layer. We've run out. Dad's had to go and get some more. Uh, so yeah, we'll get this whack plate down. Wait right till Dad comes back. And then do it all over again. So that's the second layer of stone down that we've done. And Dad's gone to go get another... Did he get half a ton of each or... Has he got a ton of each? A ton of each, I think. A ton of each. Another ton of stone and a ton of sand to then scatter over the top of this for the top two inches. And then we'll be getting his visc green in. And we need his Celotex insulation, like I said earlier. Uh, but he ain't got that at the minute, which is not coming stock. So we'll see what we can do. Right, so we've had dinner now. Dad's come back. Well, he's got a ton of each. A ton of each? Yep. A ton of each. So we've got to put some more stone in before we can put the sand down. So I'm going to go on the barrel this time. Dad's going to rake. Granddad's shoveling from the trailer. Go yeah, teamwork makes a dream work. Alright, uh, so that is stone, third layer of stone down. Now on Sanders, Dad's brought in now. Uh, two inches roughly of that, just to cover it all over so when we screed it off. Hey, we're not in the Yankee Doodle land, 50 millimetres. Sorry, 50 millimetre. Not two inches. Yeah, yeah. We're now uh, metric. <laughs> yeah, it's confused me now. 
Uh, right. So, so why we do this is we fill his base with the stone, which is in here. Then we bring the sand, which gives us that top piece. Because when we screed it off to make it flat, it doesn't pull stones through it. So it's just sand. It's just nice and smooth. Yeah, that's just why we do it. But let's get to sand. So as you can see, we've got the sanding that we got, uh, but it's not gone far. So, Dad's had to shoot off and get some more. Grandma's raking that out. We've just had the insulation dropped off. Uh, so we can get on with that later, if we can get to that. But yeah, it's going well. Dad is leveling out and working out levels. And um, so basically, whereas sand is there, is just a slight bit higher than what it needs to be. And what Granddad's showing you is a screed that pulls it all off when it's too high. It all still needs wax plating and stuff, but yeah so that's our level there that we want to be at with the sand okay. uh, so we've got to fill in all this with more sand Alright, so Dad's leveled all this off. Where it is, the reason I've done that is oh, okay. until we've got roof on, if it washes down with rain, it could run back into house. So at least this way it's gonna run out at doors here. Then when we do his final leveling at floor with a leveling compound, then we'll get it back level. But we'll do that when his doors when it's and on. his roof's yeah. on. So I've done that just to save us building out out. There you go. So all we've done is just roughly flatten it so that as insulation can sit down flat and there's no major voids in it. There'll be a damp proof membrane going on top of this now. That's the purpose of this sand so that it doesn't puncture the membrane. Then we put his insulation on and then we're going to put another membrane on top of that so that the concrete doesn't run into us. Insulation. You see that? I said all that without even moving my mouth. How good is that? But yeah. As Dad said, that's what's happening. But now we're gonna put the viscreen on, make that into some Come on, funky no, shape. We're gonna be late, Joe, if we don't hurry up. Alright. And then 
we'll do the insulation after I've done that. So as you can see on the time lapse, uh, we have got us the screen in, and uh, now onto insulation. But along the back edge, well, around the perimeter, we put a 25 mil piece of Celotex in to stop the thermal bridging, and because that brick that goes around there is cold, this is going to be warm. It stops with thermal bridging between them two. Is that right? That's right. See, I know some stuff. Yeah, it's not making it damp, so. Just because dad wants a video on it because he loves his toe. Is it actually straight? Oh, yeah, I'll give you that. £23.50 from Aldi's that. I've had it three years and I bought it in sale. Just so your mum knows. Yeah, it's definitely from Aldi. <laughs> Right, so as you can see, we have got the insulation in and Dad's just putting the last piece in. So yeah, that's us done for the insulation of this screen. Apart from tomorrow when we've got to cover it all back in later on, haven't we? We've got to put another layer of this screen on top, haven't we? might do it tonight. Alright, so we're putting another layer of this screen on top of this uh, just so it seals it in and then concrete goes on top of that, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Alright guys, so that's going to be the end of this video. They're still working some stuff out for tomorrow. Uh, but yeah, we've got all that filled. Uh, this screened up, sealed, insulation in, and then we've got to put some lats on so we can screed off the concrete tomorrow. That's what's going to be in tomorrow's video. So, thank you for watching. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. You don't have to pay to subscribe, it's all free. So, it just helps me. But yeah, cheers for watching. Peace. Peace.